What up guys, welcome back, it's your girl Pinky. Oh my goodness. I am still like digesting everything that just happened tonight. Like, oh my gosh. Green leaf season final. I can't believe it's season final already. I wasn't ready. I'm not gonna lie, I was not ready for this. I mean, but all in all, it had to happen, you know? And everything that I dream of came through tonight. Like, remember guys, this is my opinion of whatever went down tonight. So don't ridicule me of anything, you know? Mama me. And that wasn't a lot of shit up in that uh, um, preaching you were doing at the women conference or the women dinner whatsoever that was. I don't know what it is because it seems to me that was a lot of shit. And that shit went towards Gigi. Why you hate Gigi so much? What is it? I am sick of you and Gigi argument. I am sick of you and Gigi butting hair. I am sick of you now liking Gigi. I hope season two be better. Like, y'all you, you need to get better because it's annoying. Mother and daughter shouldn't be... It's annoying. You know what? I ain't gonna talk about that anymore. You know, Greenleaf writers... If y'all tell me Gigi gonna preach, I have my Bible out. I'm telling everybody else to get their Bible. And Gigi didn't preach. She said, would you open our book to Romans 3.23? I did. I did. And I'm waiting for Gigi to preach. And she didn't. Why? That was a setup. I wanted to see more of Carissa and that new guy, but it didn't happen. I'm cool with that. You know, I'm cool. But the most important thing I was waiting for, Mavis versus Mama May. It finally happened, y'all. And that scene between those two ladies was epic. Do I smell Amy? I mean, I'm saying, like, do I smell Golden Globe? I mean, I'm just saying, like, everything that I hope and dream of. Not no. I mean, if you look at Mama Mavis' face, Mavis was really right. She knew everything that was going on. She just didn't want to accept the fact. She knew. To me, personally, she knew. I'm not even going to, you know, say she didn't know. Or she's saying she didn't know. She knew. And, you know, when uh, um, Gigi was at Mavis' uh, um, club, when it was talking, I thought that for a second, I thought she was going to say, I'm your mom for a second. So, it been clear. We all know Mavis is not Gigi mom. That was one thing I was hoping for that Mavis to be Gigi mom. But it's gonna, when grandpa came, I was hoping for a lot of tea to be spilled and I was hoping for a lot of drama, but it didn't happen. You know, he's dying and hopefully season two, if we get season two, I mean, his kids will come to his a or whatever, you know, his kids will come to him, whatever. I mean, hopefully, hopefully, because there's so much family secret. That was just the tip of the iceberg. That wasn't even all the secret they gave up tonight. That means there's a guarantee of season two. So <laughs> I'm sitting back and I'm waiting. Sophia left, sad moment, you know, it was very sad. I, I mean, I had little tears up in my eyes, you know. You know, oh, her dad, that's her dad. He's not gonna do nothing to harm her. That's her daddy. He let him take care of her for a little bit, you know. None of this ain't no biggie, you know. That, you know, that happened, and that's okay. Sophia gonna be okay. Charity and Kelvin, you know, for a second, I wanted to smack Kelvin in the face when I saw him looking at his phone with another guy, but I jumped to conclusion very quick, not knowing it was something to help him, you know. I was really about to like go through my TV and smack the devil out of Kelvin's face for a second. But, you know, I think I'm Team Kelvin and uh, um, Team Charity right about now. I think they could work something out. They, I mean, the, the guy is going through something because I was very mad at him for a second, you know, and I was so Team Charity to kick his ass to the curb. I'm glad she actually sat down with him to talk which is very good. I'm so proud of her doing that, you know. And that song you sang, Charity, it was just beautiful. Just beautiful. And you look gorgeous and you are glowing. Hopefully, you get birth during the, I mean, during the winter. Because summertime, we want to see those babies. I'm just saying, like, 
you know. When Pastor told uh, um, Jacob about his plan, I was like, you slick little doll. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, no. Pastor, 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 bishop. I mean, bishop, you know. You know what? I'm just going to sit there and relax and wait for that. You know, I need a drink. Because this show turned me into an alcoholic tonight. You know, Noah, I was cheering for you. That was your first love. I was Team Gigi and Noah. You broke my heart, Noah. You broke my heart. Isabel is a very pretty girl. Isabel is very beautiful. I accept all the facts. You know, dark skin, light skin guy. That's my kind of thing, you know. I accept it. But damn it, I need you and Gigi together. I need you guys to have some babies. I mean, is that too much to ask for, writers? I mean, I'm just saying, is that too much to ask for? That's all I'm asking for. You know, I mean, 10 minutes into the show, my popcorn was gone. One glass of wine was gone. I was like, okay, these people are trying to kill me. Y'all ain't going to kill me. But Tanel was so damn good. <sighs> at the beginning, when Bisha went to uh, uh, Uncle Mac at the J house, I'm wondering, what the heck? Does Uncle Mac have on Bishop that Uncle Mac get to blackmail Bishop? That's unheard of. Like, did he kill somebody? I mean, he have to kill somebody. Did he kill somebody? That's the only thing I was see. Did he rip anybody? Do he have a biological child out there? I, I'm just saying the obvious. Like, everybody is thinking it. Like, what the f I mean, when Gigi and her daddy Bishop was sitting there and he was telling her things and he told her he had Parkinson, I was like, oh my God, that's the secret. I knew, but I wanted to be sure and I didn't want to, you know, spoil it for myself. But that was kind of sad because I had little running tears up in my eyes, you know. Yeah, I knew. That was kind of sad, but I always like to see Gigi and her dad together for some reason. It's so beautiful, so so beautiful. So top it all of Mama May Prishin. Oh my God! Remember, you know, to top this whole thing out. When I saw Uncle Matt coming out of that car, I was the what the fuck? How he got out? And then when I saw Bisha the winner, I was like, oh, yeah. Bisha did something that Uncle Mac got on him. He don't want no one to know. Uncle Mac is out. Y'all may have all your little girls. Oops, did I just say that? I mean, I'm just saying. All the little girls in the little neighborhood and in the church, y'all better be wearing those long skirts that Uncle Mac won't be like, yeah. Oh. I'm sorry, did I just do that? Yeah, but anyway, tonight was everything I hope for, you know. I hope I'm not leaving anything out, you know. I didn't see a lot of Carissa, which is kind of disappointing, but I'm still mad at Jacob for taking that offer, and he know Becky with the good hair work there. I'm just saying, you know. But all in all, Greenleaf season final was everything it was the best and i had so much fun tweeting with all of you guys hopefully we gotta renew i said we yeah we hopefully the show get renewed and season two will be everything i know that because those cats are everything this lady i mean you can ask for better cats. I'm just saying. But anyway, there's your girl Pinky. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Peace out.